If you're hosting a New Year's Eve party, you want to go all out. Lifestyle expert Lee Morsess is here with lots of ideas to make sure your party is one for the books. Welcome. Thanks so much. Everything looks great. Yes. <laughs> and, you know, it's the, it's the beginning of a new decade, yes. so you want to throw uh, a great epic party. Mm -hmm. And so the first thing you want to do is you want to make sure that you have the 2020 party supplies. Mm -hmm. You can pick them up at any drugstore or party store. And I love, of course, you have to get the glasses, <laughs> the horn blowers, the tiaras, and then uh, hats for the guys. So, again, you want to just make sure that your guests have kind of everything to kind of celebrate the new year mm -hmm. uh, and just a really fun one tip though is I really wouldn't get the confetti because it will take you a mess forever <laughs> we, had, we had a New Year's Eve party we had confetti and then it took me until we moved out like five years later there was still confetti like behind the couch Good so tip. okay so now what you want to do so obviously bubbly is mm -hmm. the big thing for New Year's Eve so we set up a bubbly bar so what we've done here is we got these uh, stemless champagne flutes and then I uh, added all different um, fruit. So we have pomegranate, we have berries, we have uh, blueberries, raspberries. And if you wanted to, you can also add like liqueurs and like lemonade and things like that. That might be a little too much. So all you do, and then everyone can kind of make their own mm -hmm. uh, like drinks. So you can just everyone, if they, you know, because some people put the raspberries in the drinks already. Mm -hmm. And sometimes it's like, oh, I, you know, I want to make my own. So this is kind of nice and everyone can kind of customize it. And pomegranates in Bubbly is like delicious. So if you haven't <laughs> had it, you definitely want to try that. I like that they can add whatever they want to add. And also you can do non-alcoholic drinks. Yes, you can, we were talking about this. You can do the sparkling cider, whatever mm -hmm. it is that you, and if you have kids, you can actually do like apple juice and things like that. So it's like really fun and uh, really easy to do. <laughs> so now what we've done here is we have an epic cheese platter. So I always, like I have people over just to have an epic cheese platter. <laughs> and what you want to do is you want to have between three and five different types of cheeses. So over here we have a blue cheese, a brie cheese, a fontina cheese. This is actually a Syrah cheese, and then you add all different nuts and crackers and dried fruit, olives, whatever it is that you like, you kind of uh, put that onto like a nice platter. Mm -hmm. The tip here is though, is trying not to have any empty space onto the platter. So if you feel like it's too much, you're okay. Just right. kind of so keep- So messy is okay. Messy is okay, <laughs> and it kind of just looks nice and abundant uh, and really easy to do. And again, with the cheeses, you want to choose cheeses that have different textures. So okay. one soft cheese, one harder cheese, things like that. And you said three to five cheeses. Three to five different okay. cheeses, exactly. Okay, so now we have little- uh, Mini one bite, everything. One bite apps, right? So I think uh, we were talking about these. Mm -hmm. So these are just actually a butternut squash soup, and I have them in these little mason jars really easy mm. you can make it you can buy it whatever works and you can have little breadsticks with it and i actually was at a restaurant once and they served um like soup right before the meal in this and i thought it was great and you can just uh you know you can pick them up mm -hmm. really anywhere really cute okay and then we have like mac and cheese bites we yeah. have pigs in a blanket um and then over here what we've done here is we have some salad that i actually put in these great little mm -hmm. uh plastic containers so for all the entertaining you know the decor stuff i got it all at burlington actually um and it, everything was like five between five and ten dollars so really inexpensive and you can actually get an extra 10 percent off uh if you donate a gently used coat uh until january 20th and this so. is cute so this is just salad so really just everything small yes everything is small mm -hmm. one bite because a lot of times you know you're kind of especially with new year's eve you're not having like a big sit down right, right i mean everyone's right. kind of walking around you've also we've talked about this you're entertaining for a full week right i mean at this right. point you've probably had guests over you're kind of like over the whole like formal you kind of want it to be like a nice kind of walking around cocktail hour type of uh, mm -hmm. type of event. Okay, so now what we've done here is so for dessert, over here I have a clock cake. <laughs> so we have a confetti cake, and then if you can tell, they're Roman numeral, uh, it just looks like a clock. So mm -hmm. it's striking midnight, uh, right before midnight. And then for um, right underneath that, we have kisses. So they're midnight kisses. So you just put out some Hershey kisses. Uh, really cute, really fun, obviously, for the kids to do. So you can uh, have a, a kiss at midnight. I like that. All right. <laughs> and then we have a photo booth. Yes, we have a photo booth. <laughs> also, these are so fun. So this I just okay. got um, at Party City. Uh, we just created this. It was like $10 uh, and really fun. And everyone can kind of like, like take you little know, pictures take little selfies here. and really fun. And you can put it, post it on Instagram or whatever. Uh, and really fun. And, you know, you can kind of break it apart and use it every year if you Great want. Great ideas, so. Lee Moore. Thank you so much. Thank and you. I what I like also, you can just buy, well, sorry, buy these things at the store and put them out. I exactly. Mean, you don't have, you to... don't have to make everything yourself. You can just go right to the freezer section. Thank you. All right. We're going to post Lee Moore's great tips on our website, cbsnewyork.com. We'll be right back.